Hello everyone, um, this is a short and uh, kind of a unusual video, but I have some interesting things that I uh, scripted, uh, some extensions that I scripted that I want to share with you guys. So first we got the grid slice and exporter. This is very useful for when you want to create like a, 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 like a tile map kind of for like large sprites. See, I have a 12,288 by 12,288, so I'm going to split it into 36 chunks by making the grid height 248. And then I, I basically use the preview there to see what layers I have selected. You know, you can see what it's actively going to look like. It's pretty interesting. You know, 36 slices. See there. I can choose multiple files if I want to, you know, PNG and ASE. Save the sprite. You can choose to save it. Um, the name doesn't really matter here, but you can choose to save it as uh, separate files or separate folders. Uh, make sure you have that clicked when doing like a very large uh, sprite because um, it can uh, crash and uh, take, a, take a while to uh, do all those. And it's, you know, better organization anyways. So as you can see, all the files are getting loaded up um, here. They're getting uploaded. Uh, you know, see, this is the first chunk, the top left. And then uh, it goes 0102. 0101, 0102, uh, 0103, you know, like a grid. And that'll go from uh, left to right, uh, up to down. So, you know, it's a pr it's pretty easy organizing. Uh, you can change the naming pattern if you want to. I don't feel there's a really much of a need for that, but yeah. So, I'm going to let this uh, time lapse. Okay, so, as you can see, um, you have to wait quite a bit. The I even thought it was broken here. But when doing extra large sprites like I am, you have to wait. You have to be patient. That patience is key. And also, do not like excessively click on the A sprite um, window when you click export. It is working. Just um, the window will be frozen, so you won't be able to see it. So um, yeah. All right. So as you see, the export is completed. The window is now uh, not frozen, and all the files are organized into their chunks with the respective frame inside the file and the selected files the selected export type all there so now i want to show you a new a different one that is called um like uh, more brushes uh yeah so actually it's not more brushes it's a custom brush tool um this one you know you can uh draw a brush based off multiple shapes and you draw in that grid you know you have multiple shapes to choose from uh, I just increased the size to show y'all. I just increased the size of the grid to show y'all better the shapes. So look at, um, you have a brush size. You can set the brush size, you know, set the color and everything. So I'm just setting some colors in here. I'll time lapse this. But uh, you click save brush and it will save to your near, it'll save to your latest brush. I have the pattern designed to source setting on. If you don't want it to draw like that, you can change it to paintbrush and change it to that. Um, but personally, I like going to square for this is for like grass textures. I like going to square and then uh, filling it all up, uh, then clicking save brush and then going to the option uh, back to the original option. We were on uh, pattern design, pattern design to source, which makes it, you know, look like that. It's a, it's a lot better. But here's the better thing. Uh, you there's on this menu there is a randomize button and it's very useful for grass textures oh I forgot to click save uh, it's very useful for te grass textures like look at that it's pretty good um, you can set it up more so that the grid is bigger so that you have more variety and also there's an undo button it's currently limited to five undos just because it's the limits of uh, the scripting um, but yeah uh, I'm trying to get that worked around yeah that's the that's that's the video and I uh, hope you guys have a good day. If you want to check out these uh, extensions, you can uh, purchase them for a dollar or if you feel generous, three dollars. <laughs> a big step up. But uh, if, if you want to use these tools, uh, it's just a, a single dollar to use them. Uh, all I ask for is that uh, if you use them in a video, that you don't take credit for them and that maybe you shout me out. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, I'll see you guys later. The links are in the description. Everything is in the description. Like, comment, share, subscribe, everything. Bye.